Hi guys, welcome back to another video. In this video, we're going to talk about how you can find a peer-reviewed journal article. So what peer-reviewed basically means is that when you um, do a research and finish up a paper, um, you get it being examined by experts in that same field of your study that the research was based upon and you've read the papers on. It is very helpful, especially um, if you want to cite other people's work. Uh, if you want to cite it, uh, your research work if you do have an assignment in university undergrad postgrad everything you must be make sure that it is a peer-reviewed journal article so um, it is actually very easy to find one so um, one thing it is very important is you must um, take take into consideration of this online resource called the national center for biotechnology information it is really a decent decent database for journal articles. So let's now dive into an example. So if let's say you want to um, find a, a um, about the P51, which is a gene in oncology. So you're going to say P51 NCBI. So whatever you want to research on, whatever your topic of interest is that you are writing on or researching about, put that keyword in. After that, make sure to put this NCBI as as a next word. So once that it gives you the journal articles mostly of the research mentioned on that specific gene. Okay, so for instance, you're gonna say um, you can click for this one, it gives you a um, journal article. Okay, it gives you a journal article of a research paper done by these people. This is a, it is it is a name, this is the date it was published, etc. etc. This is the old one, but I want you guys to take it. A very important point. So it is um, published under Neoplasia, and it is sub branch of Elsevier. Elsevier, and then you can confirm for instance is is Elsevier uh, peer reviewed. Okay, you can say it is Elsevier peer reviewed, and you can say that it is as you can see decently peer reviewed order journal article. So must to all of them uh, of the research paper has to be. Uh, peer review. So this is definitely peer review. Apart from that, most of the articles that are published in NCBI um, or stored in NCBI is uh, is peer reviewed. So you should not worry about that neither. So let's uh, let's talk about uh, maybe you want to go to research about psychology. Okay, psychology, psychology. Um, you could just say. Uh, Maybe see what, if that's a good one. There you go. So that's another article you could maybe you could find. Uh, as you can see, it has the information here. Then you can always come and check with here always online. So you could say health psychology open. That's a good journal. So as you can see, it's a peer-reviewed journal. So as again. This is a peer review journal, so you don't have to go all through these websites and how you can just enjoy the easiness. And it's very, it's very, it's very easy. Just put NCBI after every keyboard you have, and it gives you a top peer review journal. Again, you can try with everything you can, everything you want, really. Um, it just doesn't stop. You can say um, NCBI uh, tumor super research. I mean, these are really stretching. So. So you can always, um, so let's say that one. I think maybe it's an article. Again, this is another one, right? So this is again a research paper done, concluded, and it was published under the literature called this one. So you're going to copy that and make sure it is actually peer reviewed. Peer reviewed. As you can see, you can check it with the website there, but it is fairly simple. Again, you can uh, check if it's double check. Really, most of the most of them here are pre reviewed. But other than that, um, that is how you wanna uh, um, look into finding peer reviewed journal articles. And uh, it, the easiness is that once you actually find an article. The on, on the right, it has a similar article to the one you just chosen, so you can actually go into read onto there and get more info regarding to your area of interest, really. So that's um, super easy. Again, 
and you can come here and it goes so i hope you guys find this video helpful and um yeah if you have any questions let me know i'm more than happy to be of assistance thank you so much and have a good day bye